Wife liberated me. Harry mocked nothing but henpecked as put Meghan in center of his own memoir. Meghan Markle looks set to be front and center of Prince Harry's memoir, as he is reportedly set to write about how she liberated him from his misery in the royal family. Harry continued his media and publicity drive this week after revealing he was writing a memoir. Set to be published in 2022, the year of the Queen's Platinum Jubilee, he said the book would be penned, not as the prince I was born, but as the man I have become. The former working royal has been open about his mental health struggles and about the trauma he suffered as a 12-year-old when his mother was tragically killed in a car crash in Paris. Harry, has said he will delve into the lessons he has learned in his book, which will be released next year. A source who knows the prince well told the Sunday Times Harry will touch on Meghan's role in his healing journey. Harry put Meghan at the brightest place but he will leave no member of the royal family unscathed in his memoirs, an expert claimed. The insider said, in his new Californian guise, I think he'll tell it honestly, framed in the context of his journey towards healing. I think there will be a lot of the old broken me versus the new fixed me who dealt with the pain, and a lot about Meghan as the woman who liberated me to deal with it all. Harry has previously spoken of how his wife played a major part in waking him up to his surroundings. But, it is thought that he will cover his childhood in the public eye, his military duty in Afghanistan and his journey to becoming a husband to Meghan Markle and father to Archie and Lilibet. Some royal commentators have suggested special attention will be paid to his mother, Princess Diana's death. In the Sussex's bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey, Harry said he believed his father and brother were trapped in the royal family. Asked if Meghan had saved him, Harry replied, yes, without question. There was a bigger purpose, there were other forces at play, I think, throughout this whole process. I am the last person to think. But it's undeniable, when these things have happened, where the overlap is. So, yeah, without question she saved me. In their tell-all with Oprah, Meghan admitted she had no idea about the constraints placed on members of the royal family before she married Harry in May 2018. She claimed her freedom was severely limited and she was once told by Palisades that she could not go for lunch with her friends as they wanted to keep her out of the spotlight. The former Suits actress also claimed she was not allowed to get help for her mental health issues because the palace disapproved. It's is claimed that no member of the firm will come out from the book unscathed. Within days of the interview being aired, Buckingham Palace responded by saying the whole family is saddened to learn the full extent of how challenging the last few years have been for the Sussexes. Harry has said he is writing his book to give the public an honest account of his journey, Russell Myers, royal editor, claimed. He said that while Harry may address his own misgivings and failures, he will undoubtedly cast further shame on his family given the contents of his recent broadcast interviews. The Duke is reported to have hired J.R. Moring as his ghostwriter. Mr. Moringa's agents refused to comment on the speculation. Harry, who remains sixth in line to the throne despite no longer being a working royal, said he wants people to read about the man I have become. Gripper said, maybe this is the opportunity for him to have some contrition in his actions. If that is the case, I imagine that he will be largely applauded for those efforts. However, nobody's going to come off unscathed here. Maybe this is some sort of therapy for Harry, he feels he can unburden himself. But nobody in the royal family is going to come off unscathed and I think that will tell you why there is such a degree of nervousness about this book, there is such a degree 